So I'm here now with Steve Thompson from the Auto Station in Burlington here at the SOAR 2023 conference. Steve, thank you for taking the time to chat with me. Well, thank you very much for having me. Absolutely. So why don't we start, tell me a bit about the Auto Station. Well, the Auto Station is sort of, uh, I guess, my dream. Uh, had a career in a different industry, retired, and thought I'd get into something exciting, and that was auto repair for me. Oh, I just wow. thought, uh, you know what, maybe I can do something, it'd be fun. Small company, handful of people, just enjoy coming to work every day and, and actually helping people with some real problems, like keeping their car on the road, keeping their costs under control, all that kind of great stuff. And you know what? It's been fun. My God, isn't that the dream, though, hey? Uh, Do something yeah. you love and you exactly. never work a day in your life. Is that the quote, it I think? It certainly doesn't feel like work, that's yeah. for sure. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Um, so I have a couple of questions I'm going to ask you. So the first one is what industry trends are you watching closely right now? What industry trends are we watching? Well, I guess, you know, it's basically consumer spending and consumer confidence that we're all sort of preoccupied with. I mean, in, in a strong economy, which is great for you know, all kinds of things, including myself and my life, you know, people go out and they buy new things. And when the economy becomes a little more challenging, like it is right now, sort of getting maximum useful life out of the things that you have becomes more of a priority. And that is what we do. So we're looking at how do we prolong the useful life of, of you know, a major capital expense like a car, you know, for people and keep their, their sort of costs under control so they can do that great stuff like raise a family, have vacations and do the stuff that they like. So it's, it's something that I don't know that we have a, a real great feel for, but we get a good sense for it. You know, yeah. we're at the counter when we're talking to people. Yeah, that's awesome. So what are the, some of the ways that you um, have kind of worked out kind of to keep those costs down? Well, it's, it's again, it's a, it's, it's a bit of a selling strategy, but what we tell everyone is that, you know, $1 spent in maintenance saves $10 in repair later down the line. So, you know, the, the stuff that you can do to get ahead of a breakdown with sort of fluid services, predictive maintenance, preventative maintenance, that kind of thing, that's what we're trying to bring. We're trying yeah. to make a difference that way. Oh, absolutely. So you're out there giving great advice to your customers we as well. We think we are, yes. I love uh, that. I love that. And so obviously you have been at the conference for the last uh, the last few days. There's been lots yes. of speakers. We've had, you know, lots of things going on. If you had to, somebody's having fun in the background too as well, eh? <laughs> Hope to be over there shortly. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, if you had to choose something, you know, that you've enjoyed the most or your biggest takeaway from the conference, what would it be? Well, the presenters are always fun. I mean, they're always coming with new ideas. They're bringing in, you know, their horizons a little further down the road than any of us as, as individual operators. But the big advantage to attending a conference like this is the other people. I mean, we're looking at best in class, you know, repair shop owners here. All of us have different, you know, ideas on how exactly we manage people, how exactly we manage costs and so forth. And that idea of sharing it with people that know the pain of doing, you know, that, like making a mistake or maybe not paying attention to this when we were looking at that, you sort of get a good idea of what's important and what's not important. So it really sort of helps you, you know, laser focus on what you need to do. Yeah. And that's by being around the other shop owners. So that's, that's the advantage. Is that sharing of best practices, exactly. right? Yeah, yeah, I love it. Well, Steve, thank you so much. It was great to meet you. And great thank you, you so much for taking the time to chat. Thank you.